it's amazing. You can actually do tons on this. You can actually use your camera if you want to. So let me just uh, use the telescope. I heard it's absolutely awesome the way it works. So let me just take a photo. I took a photo. Okay, there you go. I've opened up the photo and you can see it. If, if I zoom in, you can actually, if I zoom in, you can actually see it on the, on the TV as well. I mean, it's extreme. I mean, the quality is unbelievable. Look at this. It's amazing the way it works. So, so cool. Well, it's completely free. It's everything is built into it, right? Pretty amazing. You can, you can do tons on this. You can watch videos. You can listen to music. Hey, what is going on everybody? I'm Riz and today's video is special. Today we got the Samsung S25 Ultra. I've been using iPhone since iPhone 4S, but this thing is tempting me so freaking hard because it's absolutely gorgeous. So today's video, I'm gonna teach you how you can screen mirror your S25 Ultra to your TV completely free. It's wireless, It's everything is built into it. You just saw it. It's absolutely awesome. So let's just dive right into it. All right, so no matter what TV brand you have or no matter what TV you have, this should this should be similar to this, this should be similar to any kind of TV you have, okay? But if you have any questions, you can comment down below. I can definitely help you out, okay? So onto your TV, the first thing you want to do is go into the settings page. Now this might look different from your TV, but it should be it should be similar, okay? So now you once you're inside the settings, go all the way down to your general settings and find a network setting. So it should be inside somewhere. It, it can be in the open, but it can be inside the general settings. So find the network settings. Now inside the network settings, go to your, uh, if, you have never, if you have done this before, you can click on network status. It will automatically make sure your TV is connected to your home Wi-Fi. But if you have never done this before, like me, I mean, I have done this before, but I wanna show you how you can start from the basics. So go open the network settings. Now inside the network setting, you can see you have two different options. You have wired and you have wireless. You want to click on wireless and it will automatically search and it will automatically search for your Wi-Fi connection. So in this case, you can see top one is going to be my home Wi-Fi. All you have to do. And by the way, at the bottom, you can see the, you, I have actually the um, hotspot as well. I would not recommend a hotspot. Make sure you use your home Wi-Fi. So click on uh, your home Wi-Fi and make sure your TV is connected to it. As you can see, your line is connected and that is pretty much all you have to do. If you wanna check the status of your network, you can click on network status. It will automatically make sure that your TV is connected. As you can see right there, mine is connected and that is pretty much all you have to do. You, we, don't need to do we don't need to do anything else on the TV. So let's dive right into it. All right, so to screen mirror your S25 Ultra to your TV, it's really simple. The first thing you want to do on your S25 Ultra is to go to, let me just turn off the brightness, go to your settings, go to your settings and inside the settings, go into your connection settings. Now inside the connection settings, make sure your phone, your S25 Ultra is connected to your home Wi-Fi. Once your phone is connected to your home Wi-Fi, that is pretty much all you have to do. Now, what you want to do, what you want to do next is pretty much simple. It's pretty much simple. So click on connected devices inside the connected devices, find something called smart view. Samsung calls it smart view, but it's actually screen mirroring. So click on smart view. It will automatically show you all the list of the TVs that are run running on the exact same home Wi-Fi. As you can see, I have these, the TV behind me is also, also on the same net Wi-Fi network. What you wanna do is click on that. And as you can see, my S25 Ultra is actually connected to my TV completely free. It's absolutely awesome the way it works. It's amazing. You can actually do tons on this. You can actually use your camera if you want to. So let me just uh, use the telescope. I heard it's absolutely awesome the way it works. So let me just take a photo. I took a photo. I'm just gonna open up the photo. There is the photo. Okay, there you go. I've opened up the photo and you can see it. If I zoom in, you can actually, if I zoom in, you can actually see it on the, on the TV as well. I mean, it's extreme. I mean, the quality is unbelievable. Look at this. It's amazing the way it works. So, so cool. Well, it's completely free. It's everything is built into it, right? Pretty amazing. You can, you can do tons on this. You can watch videos. You can listen to music. All the audio will be coming the, coming from the coming from your TV. So that's the best part as well. So let me just open up a YouTube video. You can, you can see it. Well, I mean, okay. So you got the idea. The audio is coming from, uh, is coming from the TV, which is absolutely awesome. So that's pretty much it for the video. By the way, the way you disconnect is, if you see a floating icon like this, you can tap on that. You can actually open that. You can see the disconnect option right there. But if you don't have that, you can actually go into the settings again. 
So let me just go into the settings, go to connected devices, go all the way down to smart view, basically. So click on the smart view, click on the TV that you want to disconnect. So let me just disconnect that. And as you can see, I am disconnected. Extremely simple. Pretty easy, right? Well, I hope you enjoyed it. Well, I did. So if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. I will definitely get back to you. That's pretty much it for the video. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out. All right, so that's pretty much it for the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like it. By the way, if you find this if, it, if you find this video helpful, be sure to subscribe to the channel, okay? That's gonna help the channel a lot. And if you receive your S25 Ultra, comment down below what color you got. I got the black on uh, gray, actually. It looks pretty cool. I wanted the black on black, but it, it is what it is. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the video. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.